Hi, welcome back. Thanks for stopping by. I want to do a quick video today just to show some other techniques of removing prints when they're stuck on the build platform. Now in the MakerBot replicator, the, uh, sorry, I'm looking over it, it's off camera. The platform is fixed inside the machine. And so all this work you have to do inside the machine. But on some other printers, for example, the Mental Max that I'm using, the, uh, there's a removable glass plate. And I have here a print which is stuck on there real well, and I'll show you a couple of techniques. Now I've got a video which I'll link to about this Cricut spatula, which is a fantastic tool. I use it on almost every print in combination with this printable wedge by Jetty, and I'll, I'll give you the link there so you can print these wedges. And normally what I do is I take the, the spatula, I find a corner I can get under if I can, and then I use the wedge and place it underneath the... Uh, spatula and lift the print up. But sometimes there's no edge and I just can't I just can't get an edge and I know I'll ruin the tape if I try to get in there. So a combination of an ice pack and some type of hammer or other uh, other tool to um, knock the prints off is the way to go. At least it works for me. First thing is let the glass cool. It doesn't have to be all the way but if you uh, put ice on it when it's real hot you probably crack the glass. So I let it cool uh, at least down to maybe um, I don't know maybe 50 C something like that and when you take the glass off if you look in the back you can see the print you can see how it's stuck and yeah, it'll it'll be a different color on the spots that are not uh, totally sealed. Anyhow just take that ice pack stick it on the back of the glass do that. If you're on the replicator I'll take the ice pack and I use one of these soft packs like this and just put it right down on there, push it around and the idea is that you want to cool the, the print off uh, at a different rate that the glass is cooling. And let that sit for a little bit and then I'll come back and I'll show you how to get them off with the hammer. And the nice thing about knocking the prints off is that usually you don't damage the tape at all. You have to be careful not to damage the print. Okay, I'm doing this on the floor. Uh, so I have a little bit of cushion for the glass. I don't want to do it on a hard table or hard surface, so this way the carpet helps the cushion a little bit. I'll use one of these soft blow hammers. And let's start with this X carriage, see what we get. Of course, you can only hit it in the strong, a strong part of the part. There we go. I've had these two parts sitting on ice for a little longer, and I can tell by looking at the back they're starting to release already. Shouldn't take much. There we go. 